lucky to be yours Welcome back to my channel. So as you saw, I did a quick cleanup of the kitchen and the entryway um, after I dropped Blake off at school. Olivia's home because um, we've all had the same cold for the past like week and a half. Um, but with Olivia, it finally went into her body. So she was up a little bit last night um, complaining that her body is hurting and she had a headache. So I let her stay home today because she's just pitiful on the couch. Um, I'm feeling slightly better. I still have. I'm still very nasally, as you can probably tell. Um, but I just want to start, like, tackling stuff around the house because you guys know, like, when you're sick, you have to still keep on, like, try your best to keep on top of things, but it kind of gets away from you, and um, I just want to, like, play catch up. So, um, upstairs, I have to make all the beds put a bunch of clothes away and I thought I would show you do like a spring um slash summer girls clothing haul for you guys um because the kids Olivia and Reese just had their birthdays they just turned three and five so they got a ton of clothes and I bought a couple outfits for Blake yesterday at winter so I guess we'll start with Blakey so Blake loves florals like I asked her I'm like what clothes like if I pick out some clothes for you what would you like she's like I want floral and I kind of know her style now so she'll let me pick most of her stuff but she loved this this is a like a one piece like romper it was $24.99 and it's the company Zuni Z-U-N-I-E it is so cute she was obsessed so this is the this is the front and this is the back with a little bow and they're just like pants like a pant like romper she loved the material I thought this was very like 70s um but she loved this so I got that for her this one is my favorite it's a little funky right now because part of the hanger like broke off this was how much were you $19.99 which surprised me that this was cheaper but it's just like a pant and shirt set um so this is the top and it has the florals that comes with a headband and these the high-waisted pants like how cute will she look in this she is like a little model because she's like super tall um and she's just got like the long and lean um shape so she's gonna look like a little model wearing this but I thought it would look so cute on her and this is also from winners um and it's Tommy Bahama which is super cute I love Tommy Bahama stuff um and I know you don't have winners in the States, but Marshalls is the same thing. And they carry the same stuff. So you could find all of this at Marshalls. Then I got her a dress. It's Japna Girls. I don't know what that means. This was, um, I don't have the tag anymore. Oh, there's like a pin in here. Um, but this was $19.99 and she loved this as well. Just like a floral, um, long dress so those are the three things I got for her I have to get her a lot more stuff but I'm gonna try kids closet and then Walmart because Walmart lately has been stepping it up with their clothes so she needs a few more things um, like that wasn't enough but I will get her more stuff eventually and then um, I've got stuff from for Olivia and Reese so um, Reese Bear got quite a few things she got um, a little pair of shorts little biker floral shorts she needed shorts she got some rainbow like stretchy kind of material shorts she's in a size four currently she just turned three but she's in a four she got this little mickey mouse tank top that i thought was super cute my we have a big family so like whenever it's the girls birthdays or christmas they get so much stuff it's not even funny which is nice because it takes some of the load off me and colin but um yeah, so she also got this little pink shirt with the daisies. I believe this one is from, it's Tommy Bahama. I believe this is from Winners because um, they carry Tommy Bahama. She got a pair of like hot pink Levi's shorts. Gosh, so cute. I was like, do they come in my size? She got this little shirt. I, I saw this at, Car this is Carter's. It looks like a little mermaid shirt. I thought that was really cute. My mom got this one for her. This is um, Children's Place. 
little bunny. She got some white denim rainbow shorts. These are from Old Navy. And they're size 4. This is a skirt that goes with a top. I don't have it right. It's somewhere in this pile. Where's the... I gotta find the top that goes with this. Oh, here it is. Okay. So, my mom got this for her. This was from Winners. So, it comes with a little skirt and there's little flamingos on it. And then this is the top. Isn't that cute? And it's got like the little... Um, pom-poms and then it has like it ties the skirt in with the bow on the back I thought that was so cute oh my gosh I can't wait to see her in that um and this is for and now this is for Olivia oh no there's more for Reese hold on Reese got more these shorts are my favorite they're at Walmart look how stinking cute are like I want these in my size they're so cute like a pink tie-dye um and then my mom got her this shirt this was from Winners just with like a soft t-shirt with a cute little teddy bear purse and then she got a pair of hot pink hot pink casual shorts and then she got this white top this was from this was Tommy Bahama and this was from Winners as well and then Olivia got this Minnie Mouse shirt this is from H&M so she got this little Minnie Mouse tie-dye shirt which I thought was really cute she loved it and then Olivia got these shorts from my mom. These were from um, Walmart. Like, see what I mean? Walmart is stepping up their game. Like, in Canada, they're doing so much better. This was also Walmart. So cute. And she just bought these. Like, I saw them at, at the store not long ago. It just says, run, run, run. That was so cute. Um, and then she got the same Tommy Bahama shirt that Reese got. She got this yellow Walmart shirt that just says, powered by happiness. Just like a simple yellow. My sister-in-law got her this. I think this was from Disney. It's a little Belle shirt because she loves Belle. And she got to dance with her at um, Disney World, which was super cool. So, um, yeah, she got that. I love these pants. These are Athletic Works by um, at Walmart. And they're just leggings. But look how pretty like the pattern is. I love it so much. I have to do like an organizing video of all their clothes, so that'll be up next. Um, she got this Team Unicorn Stay Awesome shirt, and it has the things there so you can like tie it. I thought that was so cute. And then this was from Walmart. Howdy, howdy y'all. I think, oh no, winner, sorry. It says howdy on the front and then howdy y'all on the back. She got these um, orangey polka dot shorts. I believe these are, these are Carter's. So she got that from Carter's. This is from Walmart. Um, grow with the flow. <laughs> Get it? Grow with the flow. Go with the flow. I thought that was really cute. So she got that shirt. Like I'm telling you, these guys are set now. She got the Tommy Bahama shirt that Reese got from Winners. This is my favorite, and I want this in my size. This is from Walmart, so you can still get it for your kids. Like how cute. And there's like a little knot tie at the back, and it says positive vibes. <laughs> I thought that was super cute. And then she got this little skirt. I think this was from Children's... Oh, no, Zara. A little skirt. Oh, my gosh. So cute. And then the last two things she got, she got this Encanto um, shirt because we love Encanto in our house. And then she got this tie-dye dress. This... What make is this? I think this is... Oh, the Gap. It's like... A, and I washed everything. That's why there's no tags. Um, this little tie-dye cute little summer dress so that's everything that um, the girls got for spring summer like I said I'm just gonna clean up the house and then I think tomorrow I'm gonna film um, an organizing video because it's like end of March um, obviously you know it's end of March but in Canada like it's minus three today but next week's gonna be plus 10 so as we get into April it gets a lot warmer so I kind of want to put a lot of their winter stuff away with the exception of maybe one or two things um, and I'll race. I have to go through her clothes. She has way too many clothes and I got to donate. Well, I'm going to give them all to my niece, um, who's only four months old, but she's a girl. So I want to like give my sister-in-law all her clothes, um, Reese's clothes that don't fit her. So I have to do that. So that will be tomorrow. But right now I've got to make the bed and I have a hamper full of clothes to put away. So let's do that. <laughs> That maybe he ain't worth it Too bad I hate advice Cause out of sight and out of mind is perfect It's so hard to decide Oh I know 
Welcome back to my channel. As you can probably tell, uh, my sickness has gotten worse. Um, I have like, I had the shivers last night and body aches, all that great stuff. So um, I am full blown sick. It has been almost two weeks um, and it started off as a head cold and now it's like in my body. <laughs> but um, I am a mom and I don't get sick days. I still have to do the bed sheets, um, you know, clean up the dishes, make my sourdough bread so we have bread for the week, um, and like a treat for the kids. So um, I thought I would film just like a realistic sick mom video. Um, I'm not going to overdo it. I just need to do like the basic stuff so my house doesn't get overrun and like really bad. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to strip the beds, and uh, it's Thursday. I just took the kids to school. Olivia was off all week because she was sick, but she's better today. Um, I think they still have a cold, um, but colds last so, so long. And they like went to dance last night, and they were jumping around, and they were happy. So I'm like, okay, you're fine to go to school. And then at least I only have one child at home to look after. Obviously, if my kids were sick, I would keep them home with me and we'd have a jammy day, but they're totally fine and wanted to go to school. So anyways, um, I'm just going to strip the beds. Um, I'm going to start with mine. I have to do laundry, make sourdough, like I said, and I might just do like a, I don't know. I hate the crock pot, honestly. I know people are a fan of crock pots. I don't like any crock pot recipes. I don't know if it's just me. Let me know in the comments below, but I feel like if you're a true food, a foodie, you won't like crock pot meals. I don't know. Maybe I just haven't found a good recipe. So if you do have a good recipe that you're like, girl, you need to try this, please leave it in the comments below because I would love to use it. It's so convenient. I just don't like crock pot, crock pot meals. I don't know. Maybe I just haven't come across a good one. But 
Um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and strip the beds and try not to pass out. <laughs> I know that you are having a hard time right now That everything seems to crumble around you I know that you feel all alone in this world But you have to Put your trust into us and we will help you through Cause we only want what's best, what's best for you I know that you are having trouble believing right now That everything is gonna be, is gonna be alright I know that you feel all alone in this world But you have to put your trust into us And we will help you through Cause we only want what's best what is best for you my dad picked them up I look and feel like garbage so easy quick dinner I just had 
some chicken, marinating in olive oil, lemon juice, and some spices. And then I'm gonna do some, where did that pot? Oh, it's over here, I washed it. We're gonna do some rice, so we're making like a fajita, cause I missed taco uh, Tuesday. Today's Thursday, so we're gonna do taco Thursday. We'll do rice, and um, I'll cook the chicken up. That's way too much water. I don't even, I'm like delirious. I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's try that again. So this will just be for calling to the kids. So we'll do a cup of rice. And then to make it extra, <coughs> excuse me, delicious, we're gonna do some organic chicken broth and boil it in that instead. And then it just makes it taste so much better. I got a new foundation to try in the mail. Um, I looked up top drugstore foundations and this was one of the first ones that popped up. It's the Maybelline Superstay foundation. I got the shade Light Tan. It's got a little bit of a yellow undertone which I like to cancel out redness. So I'll let you guys know um, how this works out. And I also got my big order of Arbonne and I'm so happy. I'm gonna take my greens, my fizz with vitamin B, Vitamin B, oh my gosh. Can you tell I'm like delirious? Vitamin B, my skin elixir, and my probiotic bio stick. So I'm gonna share those. And I also got another one of my coffee protein that's down there. So I put this on the stairs and then I have to sort through the kids' lunch boxes and Collins because I make him lunch and breakfast for work. So I gotta wash all these up. Okay, the chicken is done. I'm just waiting on the rice. That took like 10 minutes. Um, I'm gonna make a broccoli salad. It's so good. I will write up the recipe down below or I'll show you on here. Um, so I'm first gonna just cut up the broccoli and put it in here. This has already been washed. And then I'll add the sauce. It's like a fan favorite, everybody loves it. Um, and anytime I make it for a party, everyone always asks me the recipe. It's a good way to get broccoli in if you're not a big broccoli fan, because the sauce has like mayo and sour cream, it's so good. Trying to get a book? Okay. Well, you add in some pumpkin seeds. I like pumpkin seeds. Want to try some? Mm -hmm. And some dried cranberry. Ooh, what is that? Cranberry. Try it. These? Mm hmm. Can you move me? That's a lot. <laughs> I promise you, if you make this at any function, it will be eaten up in like two seconds. It's so good. This is super random, but um, the kids like a mismatch of things. So they've got chicken, some sliced cheese, avocado, their rice, and some leftover mac and cheese. Um, and then Colin is going to have the chicken and the rice. Okay, honey. Oh, okay. Um, chicken and rice in a bowl. He's sleeping right now because he has to go in for a night shift. Um, but that's what the kids are going to have. I'm not hungry, so I'm not eating anything. <laughs> 